So we are continuing on working through our challenges. We are on number two. Right now we have five diamonds plotted in quadrant one from our previous solution. Now let's take a look at a possible solution for challenge number two, which says alter the code to plot 10 diamonds in quadrant two. As I mentioned already, we do have five diamonds in quadrant one right now, and we want to make 10 diamonds plot in quadrant two. So let's start off by changing the repeat to 10 rather than five, so we do end up with 10 diamonds. We then have to figure out which X and Y coordinates to change, X or Y coordinates to change, to ensure that these diamonds will be plotted on this part of the Cartesian plane. So we know that that's the negative side of the X axis, so let's change that now to negative 10. So rather than going plus 10 each time, we'll start at zero and do minus 10 each time. The Y coordinate stays in the positive side of the axis. So let's try that out and see if it works. It should plot at negative 10, 10, negative 20, 20, and so on. Let's try running that now. So we've got our 10 diamonds plotted in quadrant number two. 